O kurwa, boys! What the fuck? Yo, what's up guys, Marcin here. So this is the quick video about the newest patch, uh, which is introducing on 21st July on our server, uh, in other essence, season three summer server. So guys, what we are expecting to be more defensive, to get, uh, to make our PvP longer, because we should stay longer, right? So for now, as far as we know, we have some upgrades according to the items. So as you can see, the first thing is uh, the limit increase for the uh, defensive items. So, Cloak of Protection from 8 to 9, okay, <laughs> not a big deal in my opinion. Petra Magation, also not a big deal. Talisman Eva plus 7, this is great, but Blessed Talisman plus 7 of Eva, this is also great. So, this is even greater. So, we are aiming for this, guys. And this is the game changer, boys. Spinel level 7. Kurva, Spinel level 7 would be fucking amazing. Why? Because spinner level 7, seven provides you uh, minus all receive critical damage, not per physical uh, magic sk uh, skill critical damage, but also physical skill critical damage receive. So this will give us uh, more tankiness. So yeah, this is big deal, and this is for sure number one thing we need to uh, we need to focus on. So yeah, this is this is really huge, and I was waiting for this for like I don't know, like three four weeks, yeah. And uh, another update is the Aden Soul Crystal Armor. There is a limit increase from 11 to 14. This also provides nice, uh, nice death. But if you have 11, you are happy. If you don't have, I don't know. You still need to wait. Yeah. But also, this is. I think this is the the upgrade for whales because whales have 11, so they will have 14. So whales will be even stronger and harder to kill. But okay, it is what it is. Some special craft enchanted items update, so you can get plus eight cloak, plus eight petram with those uh, pieces, and also uh, Eva plus six with uh, two hundred eighty four pieces. Okay, so there is a there is an upgrade for Arcan Arcan strong box. Oh kurva, boys! What the fuck, guys? This is seriously kurva big. Look at this one, because I said like. This is for whales, but look at this. For now, from the Arkin Strong box, you will have not one piece of uh, Soul Crystal Armor level one, but five pieces. Kurva, five pieces. So this means that other Soul Crystal uh, for armor will be cheaper, and there will be more of them on market. So there will be a cheaper, and we'll have more chance to get eleven. So that means that. This update is not only for whales right now, it's also for casual players. You just need a bit, a bit luck, like... You'll have possibility to have it uh, even five more times. Because you can have more pieces per part. So, wow, this is nice big. This is big change. Mm, this change will provide the possibility of developing of Arncris armor way faster at the same time. Be accessible for everybody. So this is really good and I really like it. Augmenting stones. Uh, yeah, so they added uh, augmenting stones to the to the uh, L coin store. So this is also a huge dig because you can um, you can have more chance to provide for yourself minus critical receive damage on your armor augmentation. So this is also really really big. So yeah, this is nice. Um, the augmenting stone has been added to the droppies of the monsters. On Forgotten Garden, Kelbim and Pagan Temple. Okay, epic bosses update. So they have. Uh, the start will be increased and this is good because our current because current ser server progression is uh, higher than before random craft so we have more chance to get the special armor boss weapon and rare, rare accessories okay nice finally mm, armor protection and frost weapons are currently disabled yeah that's cool a catch-up introduction so guys they will provide some catch-up introduction 
Um, those changes will be added uh, to the game on Saturday 22 daily reset, restart, after the daily restart, so in 24 hours. So, they provide the Keber, and this is Kurva big, guys, because for every other Essence server, the Keber is the thing which is the, from the beginning, but for us, it was always catch-up uh, system. And right now, finally, they understood that this is bad to up, uh, introduce it from the beginning of the server, but after one month, it's really good, cool, cool idea. So if you are a new player, the Keber will be for you guys, because on the Keber, your exp and Adena is way, way faster. So this is nice catch-up mechanic for uh, new players. And so yeah, we all know the Kebers. Uh, increase revert on low-level chain uh, quests. So also chain quests on low level provide you more exp, so that, that's good. Increase exp for character between 76 and 86 included. Okay, so this is the bonus for those characters, for 87 class uh, level characters, so that's cool, but I'm 80, 86, sorry, but I'm 87, so I cannot get it, but this is nice. Newcomer equipment kit is also good for new players, because whenever you're a new player, you can have your newcomer equipment kit, and in this kit, you will have soulbound items, uh, which are time limited, which are time limited, so you can play, you can, you can provide for yourself some items. To, to have fun and meanwhile you can collect your own items because those items will be like 40 days 30 days sorry uh, but uh, but then they will disappear and you need to equip your own items so this is also cool this is nice catch up mechanic arcane coffers uh, there is an increased reward for arcane coffers on planes of Lizardman, dragon valley beehive kruma dragon valley selma home so this is nice also a nice catch up mechanic and uh, on the same previously mentioned hunting zones, one time mission will be updated. Okay, so we can get. Uh, okay, so we can get even better item on the, on this. So that's cool. And uh, yeah, the the next thing is the arcane boxes. So you can purchase them in the account panel for real money. So hmm, I don't know what to think about that. That's kind of okay, but it depends what's the limit on that. What's the limit on that, right? So yeah, we'll see. Like, I don't know what to think about that, to be honest. Uh, the purchase limit will be set with a weekly period. So that's cool. So one per week, you can buy some boxes. I'm okay with that, yeah? The strong box will rotate every new update. Yeah. And the class balance, upcoming updates. So starting from Friday 28th, so in one week, um, every week they will provide small class balance. And this is cool because I hope, guys, that they will uh, provide some Mm, fixes for OP classes like I don't know Mage Meteor because it's crit for 10k, uh, Legendary Archer from Archer, and uh, some I don't know four star from the mm, from the Assassin. So if they can work on that uh, based on the weekly period, I'm cool with that. Yeah, because one week I can stay with OP class, but if I need to play for like I don't know one month with the against the OP classes, I'm out, guys. But thanks for that. I mean this is good. I hope they will keep it. Because this, this is something we need from the beginning. So, like, we are playing for a month, and for a month we are struggling with uh, OP Legendary Archer players, so... I, ho I hope they will make something with that. They will do something with that. During the following week, the proper announcement will be given with more information regarding this topic. So that's nice. And changes, tunnels, range... No, 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 no. Okay, guys, so, yeah, this is it. Mm, overall, I'm happy with those uh, changes, because they are, in my opinion, really, really great. We are looking for that. I, we need to have spinner guys, so spinner is the most important thing for you. Mm, and yeah, and what's more? And augmenting stones. Augmenting stone and, and uh, add and soul crystal armor. So guys, those changes are really great, so they will improve our defensiveness. And I hope the PvP will be longer and we enjoy playing PvP, because for now the PvP is retarded as fuck. But they did something to fix it, so I respect that. Okay guys, so that's it. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed guys and we see you next time.